I'll show you what the Metabo multi-perforator can do. First, it drills at 900 revolutions per minute. Then, it can hammer drill, good for bits and drills. It can also just hammer. In second gear, it drills at 2,100 revolutions per minute, close to diamond drilling speed. Classic method, let's time it. Now diamond method second speed core bit. Dry drilling, go. Oops, wet concrete inside. It's sticking to the bit, but granite won't stop the bit. It's granite though. Let's go. Hey folks, show me another drill that can make a 68 mm hole in granite in under two minutes with a diamond bit. That's not all, friends. It has built-in electronics to maintain speed while working. You can drill fast, you can switch to slow drill mode. Set the minimum speed. Speed control, safety and lock button are present. It'll hold small revs like this, see? that safety clutch kicked in for those who don't like slow crank it up to max here switch modes here start and go Here's the 32 mm drill. If that's too small, try this 40 mm. Chuck has a lock. Max speed, let's roll. <laughs> Folks, no speed up or editing here. This drill's a beast. I'm running out of ways to impress you. Two chucks included. Quick release. Anti-vibration handle. Switch at bottom. Won't accidentally activate. No mess here. Soft start feature included. Reverse is there. 4M rubber cord. Fits right. Here's the hinge. Safety locks in place. I'm fixing the button. Plugging it in. What do we see? The drill didn't start, it's signaling an issue. Let's reboot and try again. I compared it with DeWalt and Bosch drills at the same price. This metal drill proved the strongest and fastest. Any questions? Comment below. I can make another video or test. If you enjoyed, like and subscribe. Thanks for watching.